What's up you guys? Hi, welcome or welcome back to another vlog. I'm excited to be starting back up my college diary series. Today is actually the first day of fall semester and today is August 17th. I do have all of my classes online and I figure why not just kind of get ready and just kind of get myself started for the day. Just keep away from the drum She's gonna mess with your head And just like Kikaru's flies My wings were made up of wax Was bound to crash on the ground Should I watch out for the cracks Cause every time Here is a quick OOTD. So a lot of you guys were asking me where I got this sweater and it's from Hilton Head Island from South Carolina. So I am wearing my Racerback tank top from Amazon underneath and then some Nike Pro spandex. I'm going to make me some breakfast, make me a cup of coffee. So let's go ahead and get this productive day started. I just finished eating breakfast. I'm on my canvas page right now and I'm going to go one by one through all of my classes and sort of read my syllabus. First thing I'm going to do is make a list just because I feel a little bit overwhelmed with everything right now. I'm going to make a to-do list on my GoodNotes app. They do have a to-do list template on the GoodNotes app, which is honestly so great. For a familiar face and that's when I saw you Cause you don't know me and I don't know you but it breaks I just made my to-do list and I realized that I actually have a lot to do on the first day So usually I like to go ahead and read the syllabus and I've already printed some of my syllabus from yesterday when I was prepping for fall semester But I do need to go back and print some more because some of my classes just popped up today on my canvas Go ahead and take some of the syllabus quizzes for my class It's my heart you looking so blue on the last day here I just picked your name on the coffee cup but this talk of luck, the guy just messed up and gave you a cup to me. crossing off my last task for the first day of class so I just marked off everything and it feels so great they were a very simple task and I just had to take some syllabus quiz and and just have to register for the portal that will have my homework assignments on there but right now we're actually about to head to campus because I know that I need to get two access code for two of my classes and then Jeffrey also has to go buy some textbooks so I might as well just go with him and that is the plan right now. So it's 12.30, I definitely need to get on the road because I'm pretty sure there's a lot of students waiting in line for their books as well. 
So I will see you guys whenever we get on campus. Okay, so we are all ready to go out. I don't usually buy my textbooks on the first day of school just because I know that you won't really need it depending on your professors. But I do need to go and buy my access code. Um, that's about it. But I usually wait about like one or two weeks to kind of get a feel of how the class is going to be like. I know for sure that I need the access code for two of my classes because that is where I turn in all of my homework assignments. Kind of excited to go back on campus and kind of see everyone. So let's go ahead and hit the road. I want to know where I can go when you're not around. I'm feeling down. You want to stay for a moment so I can stay. I All right, so we just got back home and we ordered some pho. We got drenched in the rain and that's why my hair is no longer like pinched straight because the line at the bookstore was just super long. So we didn't realize it started raining until um, we were at the bookstore. We Anyways, I'm going to make me some pho. I'm so stuffed right now getting pho on a rainy day is just like the perfect meal ever So I probably sat here for about a good 30 to 45 minutes trying to fill out my planner So I don't have anything for this week because it's just the first week of school So there's not really much important assignments to be turned in but for next week I have a whole list of items and assignments that I got turned in so I'm definitely not looking forward to that, but I will probably get caught up on some of these assignments um, this following week since since I'm kind of all caught up anyways and I like to be ahead of my classes. I only fill up about a good three weeks worth of assignments. So this is my September calendar. So this is the second week that all of the main assignments are due. And then I just filled in the third week. And then after that, I just kind of stopped because... I didn't want to get too ahead of myself. I'm probably going to transfer some of these assignments onto my Notion just so I can see it digitally and also on my planner. I'm still struggling a little bit to use Notion and also using my iPad because I'm, I'm still not used to like digital and going paperless. So that's why I've been using my planner to kind of jot down my assignments and it kind of helps to, you know, balance it out by writing on paper and by writing on my iPad. So that is just what I've been doing. And so now I can finally chill. I did email my professor, one of my professors, because um, I couldn't order the access code online because it was giving me an error about my debit card, but I don't know why. So I think it's just the website itself that's having issues, but I did. Tomorrow's going to be Wednesday. So that means I have a video that needs to go up. It's always good to know that your video got approved. But um, I'm going to go ahead and schedule it for tomorrow. And then we'll be all wrapped up and ready. So whenever you set your video to unlisted, you can send the link to this exact video to anyone and they can view it. But it's not going live, like it's not going public. But um, whenever I do get approved, I just go ahead and schedule my video. So today's the 17th. I'm going to schedule it to Wednesday. And I'll always schedule it to 10 a.m. Then once that is done, I just save it and it should automatically upload tomorrow by 10 a.m. So let me show you guys a little sneak peek of the video. I want to It is freezing 
in my apartment right now so i just threw back on my sweater but i just grabbed one of my favorite snacks and that is built bar so i am working again with them into today's video i genuinely love all of their protein bars it's so delicious if you guys have a chocolate craving but want something low in cal but high in protein then built bar is the perfect way to go i'll leave everything in my description box below as always in case you guys are new here and haven't heard about built bar you guys are totally missing out they sell high protein bars they are low in cal they come in all sorts of flavor this one is in double chocolate if you guys are chocolate lovers you guys will love built bar they have it in orange raspberry salted caramel mint brownie peanut butter brownie which was one of my favorites they have so many so if you guys didn't like any of the ones that had name out they have a lot more on their website so if you guys are interested in checking out built bar i'll leave everything in my description box below and they were also kind enough to give us a discount code right here so use it if you guys want to save a little bit of money and that is it so let's go ahead and get back into today's video It is 8 o'clock at night and I'm going to remove my makeup. My phone is going off. But I'm going to remove my makeup because it is time to go to bed and get ready for the second day of school. If you guys didn't know, I applied for one of my canvas positions. It's an office assistant for the school of theaters. But yeah, I'm excited to bring you guys along on my work days whenever i do start working i think it'll be like pretty cool to show you guys what i do in the day as like an office assistant but yeah first day of school um it was i want to say it wasn't as stressful as i thought it would be i thought i would just be like so annoyed frustrated and all that but i think i handled it pretty well especially making the to-do list it, it really helped i honestly just want to pop this pimple so bad but I know I'm going to regret it later, so let's not do it that. So I'm going to use this cleanser from La Roche Posay and cleanse my face. I'm going in with the Good Molecules Brightening Toner. Now I'm using the Hyaluronic Acid Serum. Anyways, I'm using the Tony Molly face mask in I'm Rice for clear skin because I need it. 